BCN 3D Stratos is a program that you can use to slice and prepare your 3D models while choosing the hot end and the material to be used during the printing process, as well as the printing profile. You can download for free from our website or by clicking on the link in the description. Once the program is downloaded, start the installation process and follow the instructions. Once the installation process is complete, open the BCN 3D Stratos. The first step will be to set up your 3D printer. Select your 3D printer model from the list. You can see how the correct printing surface appears on the screen. If you would like to make use of the BCN 3D Cloud as well, you can sign in with your account on the top of the page. Type your username and password and click on the Sign In button. To add a 3D printer already registered in the BCN 3D Cloud, click on Add the printer and open the list of network printers. Select your printer's serial number and add it to your list of 3D printers. You can see that the name of the printer has changed and it is now added to your network. In order to load your first print, open the file folder and select the 3D model you would like to print. The model appears on the printing surface. With the tools located on the left, you can move the part as you wish freely along any axis. You can also scale your model and input an exact scale percentage. The rotation tool comes in handy when positioning various models. With the lay flat function, the program automatically rotates the part towards the closest, flattest surface. And with the new select face to align function, you can pick which face will be in contact with the build plate. You can mirror the models using the mirror tool. The different printing modes allow you to get the best out of our IDEX system. Printing the same part with one or both heads or printing multiple parts with both heads at the same time. If you would like to make identical copies of the same model, select the duplication mode. Mirror mode will make a mirrored copy of your model. On the bottom left, you can change between different print surface views and alter the viewpoint by dragging with the right mouse button pressed. On the top, you can also see a summary of the two extruders and the material setup and important parameters like layer height, infill percentage, support and build plate adhesion. On the extruders tab, you can enable or disable each hot end and select the hot end size and material. The hot end size drop down menu shows the hot ends compatible with your printer. The material drop down menu shows a list of all the materials available, including all the materials by BCN 3D. When changing to a new material, you will see that the indicated color changes, as well as the model loading. If you select the model, you can alternate between the extruders and materials that you wish to print your project with, using the buttons on the bottom left. On the Profile tab, you can select a recommended printing profile in the same way, keeping in mind the layer height that you would like to print with. You can also determine the density of the part infill. The gradual infill function is only recommended for the support material. If the printing model is more complex, you can enable support and select which extruder you'd like to use for this and also enable build plate adhesion to be printed. Once you are finished with slicing the part, you can verify the support material with the preview tab layer view. You can also preview the line type, feed rate and the layer thickness. You can also move between the different layers to review how the part will be printed in more detail. You can click play to see a short animation of the route the nozzle will follow. 
Apart from printing a model with support material, you can also make use of the IDEX system to produce a multi-material model, combining two different materials in one part. In order to do this, open the models. The models would already need to be separated and exported individually in your design software. Select which material you would like to use with which extruder, but keep in mind that not all materials are compatible with others. In the description, you can find a table about material compatibility. Once the materials are selected, choose the material you'd like to print on each part. Then, select models while holding the shift key and right click on them. Choose the merge function and both models will be united in one model. If the two parts don't merge properly, verify the assigned coordinates in the exported models from the design software. You can now slice your model and verify the parts have merged correctly. Lastly, to print your 3D model, you can send the files directly to the connected printer or save it on your computer or the printer's SD card.